Hi everyone, I'm Nelson from X5 Team, and today we are going to show how X5 Cybersecurity AI Embedded Notebook behave compared to others during a ransomware attack. Now, let us begin. Over here is a normal notebook with pre-installed endpoint software protection. And we have the setup configured to the zero day thread and the unknown threads are being enabled, turned on, as you can see on my screen over here. Let, let us do an overview protection with all the protection turned on, including the updates. But nevertheless, let me do a quick update. Now, we have updated the signature library to the latest. All endpoints today have all kinds of data files. In this demonstration purposes, I'm going to show you our demonstration folders, which has image files, video files, as well the PDF. Now, I'm going to execute a WannaCry but this WannaCry itself is a modified version WannaCry. In short, it's called Unknown Ransomware. Let us execute and see what's happened. Please ignore this black little box. It's purely for demonstration purposes. This black box is illustrating how an unknown ransomware is encrypting those files that I shown earlier. In the real world scenario, you will not get to see any sort of this black box. Now, several seconds has already passed, and yet the software protection with the zero day track and unknown track protection turned on doesn't or did not detect or prompt any kind of alerts or even sending any kinds of notification to the users. Let us wait for it complete and let's see what's happened next. I'll give you a moment. So see what happened. I hope you guys can see the page chart. All the parts are good. Keep that. As shown earlier, right now the image files are all encrypted. The video files are as well encrypted. And the PDF. Now let us move to the X5 Cybersecurity AI Embedded Notebook. Let me get connected. As you can see from my screen here, it's the X5 Cybersecurity Notebook desktop. With here is the dashboard. It shows all the access SSD information. Now I'm going to show you the configuration. I have already pre-configured with the ransomware protection turned on as well as the email alert. I'm going to show you the demonstration folder. In this case, the same set of folders that I showed earlier in the normal notebook. The image files, not affected. The video files are not affected. Likewise for the PDF files. Without any further delay, let's begin the attack with the same unknown ransomware. Again, please ignore this black box. It's only for demonstration purposes. See, within less than 5 seconds, X5 Cybersecurity AI Embedded Notebook has already detected the malicious activities and locked down the drive, blocked all inbound outbound data stream by forcing the operating system to shut down. What I'm going to do next here is, with the SSDs being locked, I need to power up again and let's see what happens.
At the same time, I'm going to introduce you our XPy Connect app, which you can see on my screen over here. Okay, with the email notification received as an IT administrator or the user on the ransomware attack with a date and time stamp recorded, as well as the IP address. Now I'm going to use the X5 Connect app to connect and communicate directly to the X5 SSD. Now let me do a pair, as you can see on my screen. The serial number is 46 in this demonstration. I'm going to do a pair. Now, it shows here the X5 SSD has been locked. With a mini event here showing the ransomware, date and timestamp recorded as well, and the SSD is being locked. Now, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to unlock the SSD by using a pre registered password. And there's a second layer of OTP as a security prevention. In this demonstration, I'm going to use Google Authenticator. OTP is verified. Now, let us see what happened after I do a reboot. Shut down the PC. And power up again. Now in this case, the X5 is already unlocked and it's directly booting to the Windows. While it's booting up, let me connect back. Now, you can see on my screen, let's see what happened to those files. The image files, they are not affected. The video files, they are not affected as well the PDF file. Now, let's wrap it up my demonstration of X5 Cybersecurity AI Enable Notebook. I hope you enjoy. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.